Hey, what's up, my friend? Today I'm gonna do my、uh, reading books aloud routine first. I haven't run yet. I just need to wait for an empty spot to charge the car.、Um, it's a little bit dark, but、uh, I can I can see. I would not read a lot.、Um, yeah, I just want to finish this chapter on page one zero two or one zero five. Let me see. I think it's on one zero two. Oh yeah, one zero five actually. The second paragraph on page one zero five. If you close around the pen and stop it from passing through, it will stay in you. That is why our natural tendency to resist is so counterproductive. If you don't want the pen, why do you close around it and keep it? Do you actually think that if you resist, it will go away? It's not true. If you release and let the energy pass through, then it will go away. If you relax when the pain comes up inside your heart, and actually dare to face it, it will pass. Everything, every single time you relax and release, a piece of the pain lives forever. Yet every time you resist and close, you are building up the pain inside. It's like damming up a stream. If you are then forced to use the psyche to create a layer of distance, distance between you who experiences, who experiences the pain and pain itself, that is what all the noise is inside your mind—an attempt to avoid the stored pain. If you want to be free, you must first accept that there is pain in your heart. You have stored it there. And you've done everything you can think of to keep it there, deep inside, so that you never have to feel it. There is also tremendous joy, beauty, love, and peace within you, but they are on the other side of the pain. On the other side of the pain is ecstasy. On the other side is freedom. Your true greatness hides on the other side of that layer of pain. You must be willing to accept pain in order to pass through to the other side. Just accept that it is in there, and that you are going to feel it. Accept that if you relax, it will have its moment before your awareness, and then it will pass. It always does. Sometimes you will notice that if it feels hot inside as pain passes, in fact, in fact. As you relax into the energy of the pen, you may feel tremendous heat in your heart. That is the pen being purified from your heart. Learn to enjoy that burning. It is called the fire of yoga. It does not seem enjoyable, but you will learn to enjoy it because it is freeing you. In truth, pain is the price of freedom, and the moment you are willing to pay that price, you will no longer be afraid. The moment you are not afraid of the pain, you will be able to face all of life situation without fear. Sometimes you will go through deep experiences that bring up intense pain inside of you. If it is in there, it is going to come up. If you have any wisdom, you will leave it alone and not try to change your life to avoid it. You will just relax and give it the space it needs to relax, release, and burn through you. You do not want this stuff inside your heart. To feel great love and freedom, to find the presence of God within you, all of this stored pain must go. It is in this inner work that spirituality becomes a reality. Spiritual growth exists in that moment when you are consciously willing to pay the price of freedom. You must be willing at all times, in all circumstances, to remain conscious in the face of pain and to work with your heart. By relaxing and remaining open, remember: if you close around something, you will be psychologically sensitive about that subject for the rest of your life, because you stored it inside of you. You will be afraid that it will happen again, but if you relax instead of closing, it will work its way through you. If you stay open, the blocked energy inside of you will release naturally, and you will ne- you will not take on any more. This is the core of spiritual work. When you are comfortable with pain passing through you, 
you will be free. This world will never be able to bother you again with, because the worst the world can do is to hit the pain stored within you. If you do not care, if you are no longer afraid of yourself, you are free. You will then be able to walk through this world more vibrant and alive than ever before. You will feel everything at a deeper level. You will begin to have truly beautiful experiences rise up within you. Eventually, you will understand that there is an ocean of love behind all of this fear and pain. That force will sustain you by feeding your heart from deep within. Over time, you will form an intensely personal relationship with this beautiful inner world, inner force. You will replace the relationship you currently have with inner pain and disturbance. Now, peace and love will run your life. When you pass beyond the layer of pain, you will finally be free from the bond, from the bands, from the bands, from the bands of the psyche. Well, especially the last paragraph just really motivated me to keep doing this inner work, relax and release. Once I can truly let go of this pain situation, I mean, change the relationship with the pain. It's okay to have pain, and when pain rises, rises, I simply practice releasing. I just let them go, right? Once I've done that enough, I become comfortable with the pain. Doesn't mean that I'm not gonna have any pain anymore. It only means that I have the right way out. I have the solution to deal with the pain. I'm not gonna get affected by the pain. I'm not a slave to my psyche anymore. I love it. This is a powerful moment. I'm sitting here. I haven't done anything yet. I mean, I recorded the video and I just finished this chapter.、Um, I got enough time. It's only 5:40. I will just leave my car here to charge and then go for a run. It won't take me too long, so. It's actually a great idea to finish、uh, recording the video and reading books aloud routines first, so I wouldn't need to worry my car has to move from the charging spot after it's done. Yeah, now I'm gonna find find the charging spot. Okay, I'll talk to you later. September twenty first. Today is twenty twenty four. Have a great day, guys. Someone is. Playing fireworks at this moment—it's quite bizarre. All right, have a good one.